Suitability of an exercise varies mostly among everyone, especially those over 50. Exercise is very beneficial for older people as it helps maintain mobility, strengthens muscles and bones, enhances balance, and contributes to overall cardiovascular health, promoting independence and a higher quality of life. Though there are certain exercises which carries a huge hazard or strain, the main aim of this video is to let you know which exercise you should avoid and the best fit for you. Hope you enjoy and benefit, don't go anywhere. Watch the video till the end, it will be very interesting. That said, here are some exercises that might be challenging for certain individuals over 50, depending on their health, fitness level, and any pre-existing conditions. Please like and subscribe if you benefit. 1. High Impact Aerobic Exercises Aerobic exercises are cardio exercises, this activity is that focuses on increasing your heart rate and breathing, promoting the circulation of oxygen through the blood to your muscles and organs. We can think of exercises like running or jumping rope. This is a high impact exercise which puts stress on joints at your lower body, which could lead to pain. And as you get older, your joint strength reduces little by little. Looking for an exercise to replace this with, you could try doing walking, swimming, or rowing. Want to know more about their benefits? We got a video on that. Link is above. 2. Heavyweight lifting. Lifting a heavy barbell straight off the floor requires perfect technique and strength from the hips and torso. Even if you're practiced enough to avoid straining your lower back, there's still the risk of injuring a disc. It could put strain on your joints. Weightlifting may not be suitable for those with certain medical conditions or limited joint mobility. Even the overhead press, which consists of lifting two dumbbells above your shoulders, is easy to do incorrectly. Lifting even a bit diagonally strains the shoulder muscles and ligaments, as well as the joints. You could try doing resistance band exercises or body weight exercises. 3. Behind the neck lat pull downs. The neck lat pull down is a variation of the standard cable lat pull down. The exercise is mostly the same. You sit on the bench and pull the lat bar down. However, instead of pulling it in front of your body, you guide it behind your head to your neck. Muscle activation is also largely the same. This exercise can put excessive stress on the shoulder joints and may lead to injury, especially if done with improper form. You can replace this exercise with face pull, lat pull downs to the front and resistance band pull downs. 4. Deep squats or lunges. Lunges may not be the most suitable exercise for an old person. This is because of the potential concerns related to balance, joint stress, and injury. The exercise requires a significant degree of stability and strength, especially in your lower body and core. Older individuals experience reduced balance and coordination, increasing the likelihood of stumbling or falling during the dynamic movement of lunges. Also, the forward stepping motion can put stress on the knees and hips, which is problematic for individuals with existing joint issues or arthritis. While lunges can be effective for strengthening the lower body, alternatives such as seated leg exercises or gentle, controlled movements might be more appropriate to maintain strength and flexibility while minimizing the risk of injury. 5. Exercises requiring a lot of balance. Not everyone, but most people experiences a decline in balance with age, so exercises that require a high level of balance, like certain yoga poses or unstable surface training, might pose a risk of falls. This is very essential, because the risk is very dangerous. Other exercises to avoid that requires a lot of balance are single leg stance, heel to toe walk, standing leg swings, and tai chai. 6. Exercises involving a lot of spinal flexion. Overemphasis on exercises that involve bending the spine forward excessively, when young sit ups were likely a go to exercise in almost any workout program. While this exercise does build the core muscles and healthy back and abdomen, it places too much stress on the neck and spine, and it is hard on the lower back especially for those with existing back issues. Try doing planks instead, as this takes stress off the back while building up the core muscles. 7. Isolation exercises with poor form. Isolation exercises target a specific muscle or muscle group and involve movement at only one joint. These exercises focus on isolating a particular muscle, typically to increase its size, strength, or definition. In poor form, risk of injury is really increased. It's best to avoid this king of exercise when getting to an older age. Tailor exercise routines to individual needs, health conditions, and fitness levels. Doing a mix of cardiovascular exercises, strength training, flexibility exercises, and balance work, while paying attention to proper form and intensity, can contribute to a well-rounded and safe fitness program for people over 50. Exercises is very good, especially if you are getting old. You will still have strength, even though you are getting old. Note the exercises mentioned and change your fitness routine if one is included. Thank you for watching, hoping to see you again. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you find the video interesting and beneficial. Hope to see you again. We got other videos in our channel. Please choose the left or right video and enjoy.